as Singapore looks to integrate more renewable energy into its electricity grid to green its energy mix, the Energy Market Authority EMA is incorporating additional capabilities to improve the grid's resilience and reliability. It said on June 11, Singapore has set a goal of reaching 2 GW peak of solar capacity by 2030 and has achieved around 1.2 GW peak as at the first quarter of 2024. Solar energy, which currently accounts for less than 1% of domestic generation, could account for about 10% of its projected demand in 2050. It will be importing at least 4 gigawatts of low-carbon electricity from regional countries as part of efforts to have its power sector reach net-zero emissions by 2050. The Republic currently relies on around 95% natural gas for power generation. Since solar panels are unable to produce electricity during all hours of the day, there may be a mismatch between peak supply and peak demand among households, businesses and industries. Peak demand tends to occur in the afternoons when commercial and industrial activities are running at full speed or during especially hot days. Fluctuations in solar output can disturb the balance between supply and demand, causing disruptions in grid instability. Therefore, EMA will be adding a solar photovoltaic PV forecasting model to its grid, which will help the agency to better predict solar output and take preemptive measures to manage such intermittency. This could involve dispatching natural gas, generating plants and using energy storage systems, which are essentially large-scale batteries, that can store and discharge additional power when needed to shore up supply. EMA told The Straits Times that there are two energy storage systems with a total of 285 megawatt hours of capacity connected to the grid that play a critical role in helping Singapore achieve its 2 GW peak target. Prior to the enhancements, EMA had an automatic generation control system that monitored electricity demand and automatically adjusted the output of conventional power generators every few seconds to match the dynamic changes in demand. The new capabilities allow EMA to promptly manage changes in demand and supply, a crucial enhancement in ensuring a reliable and stable electricity supply as Singapore skills solar PV deployment. The authority said. This comes as EMA anticipates demand to grow over the medium to long term as industries seek ways to reduce their carbon emissions, while electricity-intensive sectors like advanced manufacturing and the digital economy will expand. System peak demand is also expected to increase at a compound annual rate of up to around 5% over the next five years. The new energy management system is also capable of modeling any type of electricity generation plants including geothermal energy and electricity imports, said EMA. It will be equipped with intelligent alarm processing that can bolster the power system operator's awareness in the event of a power disruption, which may include equipment malfunction, for instance. This new function synthesizes alarms received from the power plants and transmission substations in times of emergencies and would help EMA respond to these alarms more effectively by reducing the risk of information overload on the operators in the control room. It also enables quicker decision-making and response to issues, minimizing downtime and enhancing overall system reliability, the authority added.